Hello everyone, it's FCA. Um, this is going to be a quick nail art or somewhat quick nail art um, tip for people with short nails. I am not in any way trying to pretend that I am anything close to Julie G713. Um, she is the nail art queen. Um, Goldie Starling has a lot of stuff too, but most of your nail beauty associations are, you know, Julie G713 and um, Love My Lightning. They, they're nail polish gurus of amazingness. But a lot of their nail stuff is associated with long nails. And for some of us with onychophagia, also known as nail biting disorder, um, have a hard time keeping long nails. And we can't always afford to constantly have, you know, long fake nails. So, my go-to favorite thing in the world for nail art, because of my short nails, is shatter polishes. Um, I know that there's this new stuff out, like it's called magnetic nail polish. I don't know, X Barker was talking about it on her channel. I'll link it at the bottom bar. Um, and it looks cool, but it's not quite as cool in my opinion as the shatter nail polishes. I like the shatter polishes just because it's a lot more random. There's a, the color I just, I just love them. The problem with the shatter nail polishes, and I'm sure other people have run into this too, is finding good color combinations because, you know, depending on, you know, the darkness, the lightness, the, sh um, if there's sheen or no sheen of the colors, depends a lot on how it actually pulls off on your nails. So for a nice fall, you know, November, um, kind of look, I have found a beautiful color combination. I'm going to try and show you this for the shatter polishes. I have really short nails. So this is perfect for people with short nails. And what I have is a gold. And this is the gold that I'm using. It's from Urban Decay. It's from their it was from their summer line actually. It's called Shine On. Um, <clears throat> the Summer of Love collection. And it's just a nice gold. This is what it looks like by itself. It's just a, a very nice gold color. It's not bronze. It's not brown. It's not beige. It's not tan. It's quite a true gold color. Um, and it's shimmery but not glitter. Um, which is very important, I think, for this kind for this. <clears throat> and I paired it with the red this from the red shatter this is the OPI version but I'm sure that they're all you know essentially the same formulation there might be some slight differences but I imagine that humans every time I do a video humans gotta yeah who are you you can wait I'll be done in a couple minutes less than <clears throat> anyway, and then, so in case you never use shatter nail polishes or you can't get the things right, you can just take it and just, to get lots of random designs, just paint it randomly on there, or you can just paint it straight. Now, here is something that is very important that I found. If you want the shatter effect, you want to make sure that you don't over layer. Um, you know, one scoop of this stuff, just put it on there and try not to over layer it if you can help it. Because um, I find that if you layer it on top of each other, even though it shatters, it'll shatter differently and you're going to end up, um, the shatter's going to end up pulling over each other and then it's just a solid block of color. And. Which is why if you're going to do the random strokes all over your nail, kind of be careful with that because you don't want to do that whole over layer bit. For some reason I thought this would be a lot shorter. But anyway. And then as you can see as it dries it'll pull apart. And it kind of reminds me of, you know, fall leaves. That beautiful, you know, the randomness of the colored leaves and all those sort of things 
it's just awesome. So I just wanted to share that with everyone. I hope that you have a wonderful November. If you have any November nail tips or anything like that for this wonderful fall season, please share them with me. I'm an open-minded person, and we can all get along in the fall. Go jump in some leaves. And hope that you don't get a slug on your back. Bye!